Hello again, everyone. It's Todd Starooch, the horror nerd here at Pennsylvania HorrorCon. We are having a blast. It's here. It's Saturday. We are very busy. I have the pleasure of sitting once again with the lovely and talented Lar Park Lincoln. Lar, how are you? Hey, I am doing so good. Thank you for stopping by. Of course, always. I had a great time with you the last time. We did. We've had some we fun. Did. You were you were like trying to you had some topics you were trying to cover quickly. Well, I don't like to take too much time from you and the fans, you know. We uh, did it. I always appreciate a few minutes of your time. I truly thank do. Thank you. Thank you. Don't you also work with some charities? I do. I work with Scares That Care. That's right. Which, That's right. yep. So we just had our uh, charity event a few weekends oh, ago in Virginia. Nice. So that was a lot of fun. And then I'll have my annual toy drive and fundraiser at the end of the year. Okay, so that's good. thanks I, for asking I about that. I had so much fun when someone came up recently and, and a shot that we had signed, I had signed, brought in like 1500 mm -hmm. And I'm like, yes. <laughs> I mean, that really makes you feel good. You know, it's not just for us to feel fancy signing autographs. Sometimes it, it creates some income for charities. It really does. Mm -hmm. It really does. Especially Scares, which is a horror-based, oh, yeah. horror-themed charity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it's very cool cool yes shows that horror people have a heart right <laughs> some of them unless they've been cut out already well and I I do have a heart <laughs> and I keep it in a jar on my nightstand oh, no, no. So, oh no my humor is unappreciated oh, in no, my time no, it's it really very is. dead humor Wow I see what you did there <laughs> bad mom joke I like oh <laughs> Listen, don't get me revved up with the dad jokes. Okay. I torture my daughter with dad jokes. Oh, I know you do. <laughs> Trust me. I know you yeah. must. <laughs> so, yes. so last time we chatted was uh, in Atlantic City a few months ago. Okay. Uh, I assume you've been busy since then. What have you been up busy, to? Busy, busy and, and working and doing things. I have Ghost Party coming out this year, cool. which is especially near to my still beating heart uh, because I'm going to be in a G-rated film. Say what now? I, they still make them. Stop it. I know. <laughs> Stop wow. our beating heart. Yes. <laughs> ghost party. It's about, I'm playing a, a ghost from the early 1900s with the tall blue hair. She's like a Miss Manners and she can move things magically. And uh, she's, um, it's neat. I actually was one of the casting directors on the film and, cool. I, and I cast many of my students, Major Dodson from Walking Dead and, and, um, just, just some other actors that have done a lot of work, and it's about a, a haunted house where the new, fa the young family meets some of the older, deadly relatives. That sounds very cool. All G-rated. Huh. Yes. I will have to check it out. Yes. Yes. So. So you said it's a ghost story. Why it's, it's is it called when, ghost story. when people encounter ghosts? <laughs> It's always someone from like the 1700s. Right. It, Nobody it's never recently. some breakdancer from 1985. <laughs> that, right? Well, exactly. Exactly. You know, I mean, It's a Wonderful Life and Scrooge are, are my biggest right. favorite films. I got to work on a project with Jimmy Stewart. You did? I did. Wow. I have pictures of it. And it was like my life. I was like, Jimmy Stewart is standing next to me. That is very cool. That was cool. I I am a big fan of the golden age of Hollywood. Like that, oh, I kind of miss no. that. Like you remember watching the Oscars and you'd wait to see like Jimmy Stewart oh, or George Burns. Just stand there. Or somebody, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, because I was glued to it. All of us that are in the industry, you know, we were glued to our black and white TVs in the 60s and 70s, <laughs> staring at it. You know, it was amazing. Now we have access to celebrities' lives 24-7. A little bit too much, right? I think. Probably. So there's no anticipation anymore no, to so see them. You're you right. Know? Sometimes that does, you know, you meet your, you meet your hero, they say, and yeah. it cannot be as exciting. But um, I also, I, I got to work with Rod Taylor. Stop it. I did on a show. I don't think it's up on my thing. It was called Outlaws. It was a TV series. And he played a, he played a cowboy from way back in the day that came to the future. Rod Taylor. And so my agent recently gave me a print of the birds signed by Tippy with Rod Taylor's name on it. And I'm just like, my life is complete. That is cool. That was cool. I have a Rod Taylor autograph, but I didn't meet him. I oh, wrote him a letter right. in oh, the mail, and, you got it and he back. was kind enough to send it back with a little handwritten note. Right. I mean, I do and that. that. Was really I cool. still have. I have the stack, and I do my. I don't get them done every month. That's for <laughs> sure. It's got to be a mood. 
Got to have a margarita ready. <laughs> and I'm going to sit there and sign, but I'll include some notes sometimes. Oh, that's and, sweet. <laughs> yeah, that's, it's a handful. But, I'm sure it is. <laughs> but you know, when I was a young teen, I wrote to book authors and different people and it was much harder because we couldn't find them. We had to find a real address of their publisher. Yeah. You, know, you couldn't like today send it to Instagram, you know, or, right. or, you know, I have an acting school, so I have an address published. They'll send it to the acting school so I can get, I can get the mail. Very cool. Yeah. <laughs> so the last time we spoke, we talked about your various movies, but there was one that I forgot to mention, and that was Sky Sharks. Baby shark, do 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 do. <laughs> baby sharks. <laughs> How did we get a baby shark reference in? But sharks. Sharks. Because I will watch. We're letting children sing Baby Shark. <laughs> I will watch any goofy shark movie, like Sharknado, Ghost Shark, Nightmare Shark, Zombie Shark. Yeah. I could go on and on. Right. So, so I thought Sky, Sky Sharks Shark. was actually better than most. It, it was actually so, had some pretty scary it did. zombie sharks it did. in that movie. And everybody else. <laughs> I don't know how they got us all together. We were in Germany when we shot that. Really? Yeah, so we you were it. on location? We were on oh. location in Germany. Cool. All of those actors shooting. It was a blast. One of my most favorite experiences. Was it really? No, yeah, just, really, because oh. I was doing Sky Sharks. <laughs> Very quickly, uh, I, I don't want to take too much of your time. Not too. So you have a new uh, project coming out that it's you're out. very excited just about. came out, yeah. Let's talk about it's that. It's called Rose Blood. And uh, my character in Friday 13th, the show was uh, New Blood, which was the new blood my character was. And Rose Blood is the continuation story of Tina 30 years later. Wow. So I, I never wanted the character to be killed, so I never did the sequels that kind of came my way. And this one was awesome. We've got Terry Kaiser in it. We've got Kevin that should be Spiritus fun. in okay. it, right? And oh my gosh, Terry Kaiser. <laughs> I don't know if you've met and interviewed him yet. I but. just did at the Scares the oh, Care wonderful. charity weekend. Yep. Wonderful. I just saw Terry like three weeks ago. It's so he, you know, he's in the opening scene with me in Roseblood, which is pretty phenomenal. And the show is free to fans on YouTube. Very cool. Yeah, so check it out. You'll enjoy right. it. It's got some scary stuff in it. But we don't have any sharks mm. swimming through. So, Lar, for whatever reason, I see the light blinking. So, I see. we seem to be having technical difficulties. Well, that would be you, not it me. Would, it, <laughs> I, right. We meaning us. <laughs> you know, so. I get it. I've but enjoyed this talk so much. I always enjoy seeing you. You're yeah. so sweet and so fan friendly. Thank you, Thank you again for a few minutes My of your pleasure. time. I truly appreciate have it. A, have a screaming day or you night too. ahead of you. Lar Park Lincoln, everybody here at PA Horror Con in yep. Pennsylvania. I'm the horror nerd, Todd Starooch, signing off. We will see all of you in the next interview. And I say, I'll see you in the movies. <laughs> <laughs>